Hello, everybody. Can you hear us? Hello. Oh, I think things are actually starting. We're coming in hot. Let's yeah. check it out. Definitely didn't forget this was happening. No, and there's the audio. <laughs> Welcome to the Nintendo Directs. Hell yeah. What are we going to see today? I don't know. Nintendo Knight, stuff. Metroid Prime, Prime 4. All the stuff. <laughs> Red Steel 3, I'm seeing in the chat. Yes, all of it. Luigi. Luigi's always here. Hi, yeah. folks. Hot takes. We did make it, though. We did. <laughs> we did. Just in time. <laughs> we'll peek behind the curtain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, Mario and Luigi. Sure, Mario and Luigi. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get Together my notes again up here. for the first time. Give me one sec while I get my notes together. I'm just gonna keep enjoying Mario and Luigi doing Mario and Luigi. Things. Please do. Oh, Luigi, will you ever land? No, apparently not. Even in the no. year of Luigi. I like the Luigi games. Benny, I regret to inform you it has been more than 10 years since the year of Luigi. Wait, really? Yeah. It's always the year of Luigi for me. I forget, is this like a known remake of one of the old ones or is this a new one? I don't know. It doesn't look like a remake of something, but I don't, I don't play a lot of these games. I'm sure someone will helpfully come along and say yeah. what this is in a moment. New? This seems new. This looks new. Ah! Brothership! Brother- Hey, there's a game in November! Holy shit, we found one! Hello, everyone. <laughs> I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. That was the first new entry in the Mario and Luigi series in almost nine years. God, has it been that long? Brothership. <laughs> Please look forward to a seafaring This is a Brothership check-in, all right? <laughs> uh, as well as evolved bros moves with Mario and Luigi. I feel like they're, is, okay. I can't tell if it's the art Let's style the or they're changing the Mario's look a little bit. It's the art style, I think. Bring the championships home. C the or Chris Pratification of Mario. The thrill there you the go. The Nintendo World Championships is heading to the Nintendo Switch system. Take on over 150 speed running challenges from across 13 Yeah, I want to be clear. NES they got out ahead of this and said, we are not talking about the successor to the Nintendo Switch today. So No. No, whatever's next for the Switch, we'll hear about it here. And perfect your no. Timing. Then give it I bet we hear something about that before the end of the year, for the though. Top of the online leaderboards. You can also try more difficult legend challenges. I do not want to try more difficult Super legend Mario challenges. In one go using warp pipes. If anything, I want these names to be easier. <laughs> Stuck on a legend challenge? Check out classified information for handy tips and That's tricks cute. to help you improve. Mm -hmm. Put your skills to the test in survival mode. Yeah, show the We're children what it was like when we had manuals. Yeah. Worldwide. After each round, half of the players will be eliminated. You've only got one shot And to sent to the island. Will you be the last one standing? This really just feels like... Nintendo World Championships NES Edition. A game made for Dan Riker. Nintendo Switch, or, yeah. or button mashing. A game made yes. for button mashing. Dan Riker and, now and Rich Gallup. Yeah. Shop. A deluxe set containing a physical version of the game. And all right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, okay, okay. Yes, you are tugging at the right heartstrings there for the me. Uh-huh. Fairy tale is about to begin. I'm not mad at it. <laughs> we live the climactic Alvarez Empire arc from the hit anime fairy tale in this action RPG. No, I think I'm good on this one. Kingdom of Fiore, 
Team Natsu prepares to finish their fight. Wait, is this like anime it's Italy? Is that what we're doing here? Oh, I hope so. Unleash powerful attacks that fuse different kinds Italia of magic based on who's in your party. Ital it's Italy, it, Italy anime. Work together with your teammates to <laughs> Italy anime. Did I get there? Did yeah, I find I think, a way to I get think there? you got it. I think you found All the right. right combination. Fairy Tale Two. I'll go with Animalia. <laughs> How about that? Okay, kid gloves. Ah, yes, Fairy Tale, the shonen anime that even shonen fans will tell you not to watch. Great. All it. right. On a multi-dimensional journey. I didn't spend a lot of time on that. From Final Fantasy series creator Hironobu Sakaguchi and composer Nobuo Uematsu comes the turn-based RPG Fantasian. The world is slowly being robbed of its civilization. To restore his memories, Leo must confront an evil entity threatening all mankind. Skills are the ticket to winning battles. Adjust a skill's trajectory to skills. target multiple enemies at once. Come on, Magic! Come on, Magic! You can also send enemies you've encountered to a separate dimension and fight them later. Great. The more enemies there are, the more you can wipe uh, That clearly says dimension, shot. not dimension. <laughs> Did it? Yes. Now, let us save the world together. Fantasian Neo Dimension launches on Nintendo Switch this holiday. Another sport is coming to Spoko Square. Oh, what? We invented basketball. basketball. <laughs> as a free update to the Nintendo Switch sports game. I legitimately Dribble, forgot this existed. I pass, think I did too. And shoot. How do you dunk? In Show me how you dunk. Two matches using motion control. Or Shaq. How do you I don't do that? Shaq attack. How do you do the big dunk? Try out three-point challenge solo and score as many baskets as you can within the time limit. Up to four players can also compete in five streak battle. Well, that seems really annoying. <laughs> Besides local play, you can team up with players worldwide. One hundred percent dog. Online matches. I'm going to say this is not the most thrilling representation of basketball I've ever seen. <laughs> dunks its way on like, it doesn't look horrible or anything. It just, yeah. it's like, uh, yeah, yeah. There's a little guy. Hey. Listen, you want to get your hair like that, you got to plug it in for at least 18 hours. Okay. One of these. All right. Yeah. There you go. Like an Ori. A, a Hollow Knight? Yeah. I mean, look, Silk Song's never coming, so here we go. Here's <laughs> Mio, Memories in Orbit. Enjoy. <laughs> Mem memories it's of Hollow Knight 2. Yeah. Classics. Leap into a new update for Disney Illusion Island. Remember this? I do remember this. Solving a mystery, and I have not played Mickey this, but I do remember this. In the brand new adventure, Mystery and Monarch. Uncover hints and evidence scattered throughout the world. Then use the dashboard to crack each case. What big secret? Wow, you did it! End? Start sleuthing because connected two strings. <coughs> to That'll hold up in court today. <laughs> what are you, a lawyer? Hello, kitty. Island adventures await. Wait. Customize your character. Yes, this exists. Then that wasn't just an update for Animal Crossing. Karomi. And other familiar faces in this open world no. adventure. 
team up with your new pals to solve mysteries and restore Friendship Island when Hello Kitty Island Adventure launches as a timed console exclusive on the Nintendo Switch system next year. You can't keep Hello Kitty next year on oh, no, ex- a... <laughs> How long could this possibly be taking? In this wacky sports game. Play as Bugs Bunny, Daffy Duck, Porky Pig, and more across four arcades. No, you don't get to and more Taz. You, you right? just, he got lumped in. Taz is a fucking cultural icon. He's a headliner. Watch out for falling anvils. Looney Tunes. You absolute fucking dolts. How dare you? This fall. What's up, Duck? That's all, folks. Let's see if you can be a BPA game on. Oh boy. Emergency meeting. What for you bury me in the cold, cold sand <laughs> <to a mother. laughs> Nice. Alert others nice. when eliminated as a noisemaker. Plant tracking devices on others as a tracker. Or turn invisible while taking out players as a phantom. Suss things out when this free update for Among Us sneaks onto Nintendo Switch later today. Oh! A monster army is at your command. Those are corgis. This is a and they're of beautiful. That's what you're calling my monster army is the, <laughs> these corgis? And play a vital role okay, in there's other monsters. Civilization. Ten of Farmagia must rise up against the oppressive Magus to stop his vicious reign of the underworld. Raise monsters and lead them into the fight against the Magus's army. Plant seeds. Gr- grow crops. Then cultivate. And harvest them to make your buddies come to life. Ah! Hell are uh, we the doing? crops coming in a little bit rotten this year. <laughs> Squirrels ate my corgi crop. <laughs> Give commands to your monsters and exploit enemy weaknesses in action pack. We really are in the end of life span here for the Nintendo Switch. So let's just let's just drink in what they got for us, okay? Uh, yeah. Hey, a new Mario Luigi. That's pretty cool. I'm okay that, with that. Yeah, yeah. I might even play that Hello Kitty, Kitty Animal Crossing. I, I mean, it's coming out next year, so maybe not. I don't you know. Might, maybe you'll play it on a different Switch. <laughs> Donkey Kong Country Returns, originally released on the Wii system, is barreling onto Nintendo Switch in HD. The villainous Tiki Tac tribe has hypnotized the local wildlife. And yeah, you're just not going to get me excited about Donkey Kong Country, country ever. I'm sorry. I, I literally sat out Burgle My Bananas so I wouldn't have to play it. <laughs> Pound him. I, you could get me excited about a new Donkey and Kong Country. Sure, I would give a new one each a shot. I don't want to yeah. play an HD update of an old no one. Yeah. Because I don't bananas. like the old ones very much. Heard it's got a great soundtrack. Yeah. Depends on who you ask. To high no, it's fine. Rocket barrels. Soundtrack is fine. And even hitching a ride on Rambi. There are plenty Hurt of Rambi. transportation <laughs> methods available. Pass a Joy-Con controller to a buddy for two-player local co-op. 80 appealing levels are in store, including the additional levels from the Nintendo 3DS version. Donkey Kong Country Returns HD. Swing Again. onto the Nintendo uh-huh. Switch system January 16th. January? <laughs> One of Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong's January? Returns in HD. <laughs> For saying, a Donkey Kong HD <laughs> update that's already come out? He's saying Diddy six Kong. months ahead is uh, <laughs> Next, please take a look maybe at this. a little bit too long to get in front of that oh one. Oh my god. I'm really trying to be up <laughs> upbeat here, man. <laughs> January? Jan- January. January. Games can come out in January. It's okay. Well, get prepped. Get, get psyched. Come on. Whoa. HD 2D remake. That does not roll off the tongue. <laughs> it is. I am excited. That's <laughs> great that they're the doing this, beat. but that is not a great t- a title. Did they do this for one and two? I thought maybe they did. 
memorable encounters, perplexing challenges, and for me, I'm hearing no. I'm hearing okay. no. Okay. Why would we skip right to three? An iconic RPG Is three the first one on HD like 16 TV. bit? Hmm. I don't know. I thought there were like 27 on the For Nintendo. There are like a thousand of these, yeah. <laughs> the legacy. People are saying one and two are pretty basic, so they're just skipping them. I don't know about that. <laughs> I did play Dragon Quest One, to be fair, and granted, I was a child, but I do have some fond memories of it. D two D remake. Folks are saying three is the, three is the one. All right. Okay. I don't know if I ever actually played three. No, I did. I I didn't uh, latch on to the Dragon Quest stuff. I, I latched on to Dragon Quest way more than I did Final Fantasy, but I also really only ever played one and two, and I only ever rent, rented them. Mm. Uh oh, uh oh. And one and two. Mm -hmm. er, we're proud to announce we're deleting one and two what? from what? our hard drives. Wait, what? Oh, they are doing this. What? <laughs> wait, wait, <laughs> wait. Wait a minute. Nintendo. <laughs> Wait a minute, what was the order of that announcement? What was happening? I guess so three. Wait, they're doing all of them? I guess three is the one that you like lead with, and then you're like, eh, by the way, we'll do one and two. All right. Sure. We even snuck in other Dragon Quests. <laughs> sure. Oh, okay. Sure. Okay. Hey, this could get me to finally finish uh, Dragon Quest 1, 2, and 3. I do really like that their pitch for this is, Hey, if you play them out of order, maybe something interesting will happen. Uh-huh. Mm? Thank you, Mr. Hori. Whatever, Dragon Quest is cool. I ain't mad at it. Yeah, I, I have nothing against it. More of a Dragon Warrior fan. Yeah. Let's no thanks. Fun. Go. Nope. Say hello to. Turn this stream Jaws? off. <laughs> Wait. He man. Oh my gosh. Great Scott, is that Marty McFly? Oh, this is. The, the world of fun. I really try to be tolerant to of people's collecting habits because I certainly uh, have my ages. own, you know, Play predilections toward collecting dumb shit. As you explore locations based on over twenty iconic movies, there is TV nothing. Shows, and about a Funko collector that I will ever Use defend. Special skills and crafted gadgets to Funko collecting, to me, again, I'm also a collector. Funko collecting is like, puzzles, even I recognize that it's an infinite black hole. Bones, yeah. Dinosaurs from Jurassic World and Cylons from Battlestar It, it, it reminds me of Beanie Baby They're stuff, honestly. Like, I've just... Around. No, because the Beanie Babies were cute. <laughs> and they look, some of them look different Nintendo from one another. Mm. September 13th. We've got a smorgasbord of spooky, silly, and strategic games. Ready for an adventure of ghoulish okay. proportions? I think we had this yeah, when I played, right when I played it on 3DS. I was ready for that. Explore multiple mansions. I mean, look, I'll play this new version because yeah. I, there is no bad ghosts. Luigi's Mansion game. They're all at least pretty good. Traps. I did think this game was too long and kind of padded out in a way that was not great, but maybe they fixed that. So it was a great 3D game, and I don't know what they're going to do taking that out of it. Which which one was Dark of the Moon? That's the, that was the 3DS one. That's a, so wait, is that's, two, that's what this one is the remake of. Oh, okay. So they're just calling it 2? Did they get rid of Dark of the Moon? I think it was always Luigi's Mansion 2, Dark of the Moon. Oh. Decorate your island however you'd like, and more. Plus, up to four players what in is this? co op can what is this? to catch special Dempa Men. <laughs> what is... The new Dempa Men is Fuck, I don't know. <laughs> and launches as a timed exclusive on Nintendo Switch July 22nd. I wasn't going to play that anyway, it's fine. Strategize away in this tower defense installment of the Metal Slot series. Take control of your forces. Sure, yeah, this looks interesting. Is there a demo for this? No, there was a demo for Metal Slug Tactics, which is the new uh, thing that is coming to PC, to I think. Okay. Tussles. Unless this is that? You can also slug is this not that? Is this that? Online battles. 
Metal Slug Attack Reloaded. No. 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 System later I didn't play the demo. Metal Slug to me was always in a like, hell of a game for uh, Neo Geo stuff that I was like, oh yeah, animation here is just amazing. To the gothic roguelike RPG. Board your stagecoach and set off across a decaying I wish I liked this game better. Apocalypse. It's not bad. It just wasn't Find what I wanted from the sequel. Fiends in turn-based combat. And upgrade your abilities. This is more of a me problem, run. I think. Darkest Dungeon That's okay. 2 launches on Nintendo Switch July 15th. Pre-orders begin later today on Nintendo eShop. Yeah. More classic titles are on the way. Oh. All right, what oh, Wonder no. Swan games? Oh, wow. All right. Link's oh, no. Adventure and team up online What's wrong with Four Swords? Randomized dungeons My kid keeps, Max keeps on asking for it. Four swords. I'm like, well... Uh, but I don't have the expansion, whatever thing. Experience the remake of Samus's first adventure in Metroid. I have Zero the like mission. regular thing. You don't get this with the regular thing, right? Plus, no, I don't coming think so. To the new Nintendo 64, Nintendo Switch Online Mature 17 Plus Collection of Games. You can't just throw all those words into one title. Brave the dangerous lost land to stop ah, the Turok, the one of the worst launch Turok, games that I sure did play hunter. a lot of. This game sucks so much ass. Yeah, and I played so much of it. The plat idiot. remember the platforming on and the view controls were on those yeah. like yellow buttons. Oh my gosh. Fucking hey, trash. Perfect Dark is finally coming out. Their alien conspiracy in. I have dozens perfect of hours dark. in Turok and it's now fucking horseshit. Multiplayer. <laughs> All four games will be available for Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members later today. <sighs> I love mature video games. Maybe you could just watch a video of Four Swords. To save the day. This is Verona, a young woman with the ability to communicate with phantoms. I will take all of this girl. Join her on a journey to save her friend Ash. <laughs> in this new installment in the Phantom Brave series. Ash, the you the bomb in Phantom Brave! <laughs> there are Take games for everyone. Turn -based battles, where you'll combine the phantoms you befriended with objects in various ways. Well, as long as it's various ways. If it was just one way, I would be out. Objects to maneuver them. <laughs> combine with a cannon to attack a large area. A fan to blow enemies around. Or combine with Morona herself for show stopping abilities that can turn the tide of battle. Fusions? Phantom Brave. No, the legally they can't call them that. Launches on Nintendo Switch. Fusions with a PH though. 2025! What are uh -huh. we doing? We're what are we doing? We're getting out in front of it. Hey, I don't know what I'm gonna play. Donkey Kong or Taking Ryu for a ride. The Nintendo Switch is the Jimmy Carter of consoles. It doesn't matter if you put it in hospice, it will live for another 50 years. <laughs> Deep Jimmy also, Carter reference. <laughs> Loves peanuts. Listen, Tim Heidecker on Twitter every day updates us on the status of Jimmy Carter. Is that true? Current status, no change. <laughs> is that right? Yes. <laughs> Hit up training mode to polish your fighting skills and combos. All right. Select online mode to challenge rivals around the world. <laughs> or play co-op in the Punisher. Hell yeah. You can also I have a weird fondness for that Punisher beat up, and I don't really know why. Or listen to music from each game. I want to take a ride. Marvel vs. Capcom Fighting Collection Arcade Classic. This is cool. Yeah, Nintendo that's Switch totally cool. I'm into that. Year. And this year. Great. This is finally the announcement for me. <laughs> Uh-oh. The latest game in the Mario Party series takes place on an enormous island resort. Get ready to jump into the biggest selection of Mario Party minigames yet in Super Mario Party. They put that Marvel vs. Capcom thing in front of this just to try to soften the blow, and I appreciate that. <laughs> you'll compete to collect the most stars. Oh, fuck. Take the escalators to travel between floors in Rainbow Galleria. 
Use in-game coins. Why would you star. call it that? You already have Coconut sale. Mall in but Tannen. Mm, this is a Why different island. Why do you need another mall? Stay on track <laughs> in Rollum Raceway. How big is the, the Mushroom Kingdom? <laughs> Infinite. You can move up to 40 spaces with a lucky roll. Here on 40 Google spaces? Lose, the ebb and flow of the tide can change your path. And things really get mixed up. When How many turns? How many turns? It's top. Along with five new game boards, two boards from previous Mario Party games make their return. Some mini games are action packed challenges. Speed trials. Some are a fucking nightmare from which you <laughs> wish you could wake up from. And some are controlled by gently shaking or tilting your Joy Con controllers. Mm. Uh huh. 110 mini games. There's okay. a lot of variety <laughs> to enjoy. I don't know, I saw also, that arm wrestling thing and I just thought of, hey, we're recording the watch cast today. Yes, yeah, right. <laughs> I'm the boss. It hurts Compete my arm when you go down <laughs> like this. Return to neutral position. Try your best <laughs> Starting positions. Wait, there are even more new modes? What? The biggest Mario Party yet will soon be underway. Wait. When the Super Mario hang on. Party Jamboree game launches on okay. the Nintendo Switch Are they just getting October giant 17th. eggplants dropped on them? Yeah, they were chopping them up though. Does Nintendo know about that the eggplant the emoji and that whole thing? The Mario Party they would tell them. Oh. Super Mario Party Jamboree. With new boards, no. Okay. Games, well, good luck with that. <laughs> 20 player online gameplay and more. Get ready for the biggest Mario Party in series history. And now, please take a look at this. Okay. They're going to be so bummed when they don't snap anymore. No, they'll snap forever. Doesn't matter if they stop making switches. They'll keep snapping forever. That's their gimmick now. What is this? Um, a little Link. There definitely is a little Link. What are we doing? Is a roguelike Link? Ooh, we got Pig. Pig Ganon. Are they remaking the first Zelda? Did they make it cute? I bet this is a roguelike. Oh wow, they let Zelda have an adventure. Bye, Link. God, I'm so glad I'm done with that guy. Finally, my kingdom is safe. <laughs> <laughs> that fucker is gone. The one uh, who keeps waking Ganon up. Yeah. All right, <laughs> time for infrastructure week. <laughs> we got a lot of rebuilding to do. Echoes of wisdom. Huh, it's a new Hello, thing. Everyone. I'm AJ Anuma. Anuma, producer of the Legend of Zelda series. <laughs> What, I, what you just saw was the latest installment, The Legend of Zelda, Echoes of Wisdom. This time around, Link has vanished. Now, it's up to Princess Zelda to step into the protagonist role. You might be thinking, will Zelda fight with a sword then? <laughs> Here, I was thinking that. I wasn't, I wasn't thinking that. Style that breaks conventions seen in past Legend of Zelda games with a top-down perspective. To explain more, please take a look at this video. Stolen away across the vast. I hope they give her a Ohio, giant Gatling gun. Strange rifts <laughs> They're gonna give her like happy magic or something. <laughs> something like oh, she, she the fights with the ma alone? magic she's of not Peach is the, is the thing. Tribe. Like Zelda is is, is a little harder than that. She's a damn ninja. Yeah. Sets off on a journey across Hyrule to save her kingdom. By waving the tri rod at a table, tri -rod. Screen, Zelda learned how to create an imitation of it called an echo. Once you learn an echo of something, you can recreate it whenever you'd like. What the hell? Even Does she fight with tables? Blocking your path. Is she one of the Dudley boys? Of tables <laughs> to get a leg up. Zelda, <laughs> just like get that. the table. <laughs> we didn't give her a sword. We gave her a table. <laughs> Old beds and unusual things like water blocks. How you use them separately or together is entirely up to you. Learn and create echoes. This is neat, actually. Yeah. Exploring Hyrule. 
Like, it's cutesy, but, like, that's fine. You like, we just got a big 3D Zelda, so let's do something different. Even battles will look different. You could pick up and throw a rock echo, for example. That's not all, though. You can also create echoes of monsters. After doing so, they'll fight by your side. Monsters have different abilities. It creates a real so ethical quandary, but we're not going to talk about it. On the situation. <laughs> Wisdom is key after all. Are you spending some currency to make these things? Can I uh, echo the frame rate? In a high rule without link. Yeah, can you double the frames? The yeah. The fate of the kingdom is now in Zelda's hands. How was and that? She's just gonna build tables with them. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration. <laughs> yeah, it seems neat. Ability, yeah. Which channels Princess Zelda's wisdom. A nice little surprise. A lot of echoes in this game. To be honest, I haven't counted them all yet. How you yeah, Ron Ladd asking the real question, where does this fit in the timeline? Uh-huh. In short, we've created a game where each player's experience will be different. We're adding another branch to the timeline. The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom launches September 26th. I don't know, this a one takes place after the Game Boy one. Fuck it, who cares? By the Legend of Zelda series will also be available at launch. I don't know if you we want to buy a new Switch right now. Playing as Zelda no, I wouldn't recommend that. Under, no matter what Anuma now, tells you, do like not buy a Switch. I'd stolen away back to Mr. Unless it's like super on sale or it fell <laughs> off the back of a truck. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Aonuma. Please look forward to the newest entry in the Legend of Zelda series. Cool. Let's see a few more headlines. That would have okay. had a whole booth at E3. That would have been their booth. That whole, yep. like a whole... Party on. Oh boy. Well, this, this wasn't even in the Ubisoft presentation. <laughs> they just put it in the Nintendo. There goes our archive. It's fine. It wouldn't be a real show if we didn't get at least one copyright thing. That's <laughs> true. It's true. I'm just going to say it. I know I'm a harmonics homer, so, like, I get it. Feel free to dismiss what I'm saying. Totally out of hand. Uh-huh. The wrong dance franchise won. Interesting. I still think Dance Central, despite its reliance on technology, uh, yes. is absolutely not viable uh -huh. in 2024, they backed was the wrong, a better game. They backed the wrong horse. Wrong yeah. tech. New Lego Adventure is on the horizon. I, I know kids that just put it on and it's don't even the hold the controller the and dance. In Lego yeah. form. That's the thing. Join this the one won because it is super easy for anyone to get into, and I totally get that. I'm not saying they're bad games. I'm just saying I really like what Dance Central was doing. Climb up onto tall necks and traverse other locations inspired by the original game. But be careful. Swarms of machines are lurking everywhere. I really wonder what the crossover here is in these audiences. I mean, they probably know what Horizon is, at least. To mighty sawtooths. You might even come across the I've been told those Lego sets have existed for a while for these, and I bet As they probably progress, do pretty well. I bet they, yes, they probably home. track how well they're selling, but I wonder if those are adults buying those. Lots of outfits. Yeah. Oh, and you don't have to explore this vast wilderness alone. Team up with familiar faces from the world of Horizon in two-player local or online Like that guy and this person. <laughs> Look, I like, I'm a big Lego Horizon, Horizon fan. I don't know if my kids Switch would like it. This holiday. Name some of the other characters that aren't Aloy. Oh, boy. Uh, Aloy's friends. And, uh, -huh. uh, gosh, it's been a bit. Um, uh, the, the, the Aloy's friend that's not a friend that helps her. Uh-huh. The guy exactly. who's miss missing an arm. No, who's the guy who passed away? Who um, was the, 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 the other tech guy? Uh, the actor, he passed away. Who was in it, and they put him in, they put in the... Uh, oh, Lance Reddick. Yeah, Silas. Yeah. Silas, yes. That is the one character I think of other than Aloy when I think of that game. Silence, Silence. Silence. 
there are good characters in those games. I just can't. I, I really liked the her friend, um, who's the archivist, in, that they introduced. She was a lot of fun. Cool name her. Friend. <laughs> Friendo. <laughs> Careful, though. Look, Horizon, the last Horizon was all about like Mass Effect style they getting the crew together. Yeah. Ready to swarm. That she crew of people whose names are super memorable and you remember. <laughs> you know, Whimsy right. Steve it's not, it's and not, fucking not, Razor wait, Clam and all them, you know? <laughs> it's not fair. I have a terrible memory. <laughs> but it's true, I could, I could pull Garrus and uh, Tali and the rest of the Mass Effect crew is still out of memory. Yeah. Home, also, people talk about how that version of Stray doesn't look like it runs super great. You're super right, it does not. From the Lord of the Rings. Now, that said Stray, pretty good game on other platforms. Wait, Private Division is making a game? Can be yours. This Customize might be the last one, appearance. my friend. Decorate your home and settle into life in the Shire. As a newcomer to the little haven of Bywater, you'll befriend your neighbors, work together to solve problems, and even Finally, an animal crossing for people who shower once a week. Explore, <laughs> garden, fish, forage, and cook. Uh oh, what's that the sound? The orcs are coming. Now you're mm -hmm. all in trouble. Dinner party with your homemade dishes. Plus, you can trade with your neighbors for unique decorations. Weird these <laughs> ingredients. <laughs> Instead of a giant meals. eye of Sauron, it just says Friendly 2K <laughs> be uh -huh. be beaming down on our thing, Tales and the, the drums Shire are beating. Launches on the Nintendo the Switch of this holiday. <laughs> Beams down upon us all. Investigate. Interrogate. Sure. Yes. Check. Yes. Objection. Two Ace Attorney spin-off games, including a sequel that was previously unreleased outside of Japan, are coming to Nintendo Switch as one Because we got to get some shit on this platform, okay? <laughs> prosecutor Miles Edgeworth take the case out of the courtroom Whoa. and investigate crime I'm, scenes. You were never meant to see yeah. Ace Attorney yeah. characters move like this. No. Then use the power of logic to solve challenging cases. Enjoy all new hand-drawn character visuals from the original series character designer. It does look real sharp, actually. Whoa. For a more classic look. Take a break from your investigation. Yeah, I don't like the classic look as much. Gallery, <laughs> where you'll find character art, I was just playing music, through um, these with my kids, the original ones. More. I think they're they're cool still games. hold up. Past yeah. Yeah. Collide as you uncover Did you know there's an anime? Yes. Okay. Cost. I've never seen it, but I know there is. Ace Attorney Investigations Collection launches on Nintendo Switch September 6th. Pre-orders begin later today on Nintendo eShop. Watching the same Nintendo presentation. Watch the same games. Burn it down. Mm -hmm. After a devastating attack by unknown assailants, I gotta say it, these guys are not scary. Turned upside down. <laughs> if these guys started wrecking my town, I would probably just side with them. Suddenly appears. How about this guy? While Takumi manages yeah. to get out of harm's way. He's then forced to enroll at the Last Defense Academy, along with 15 other students. Why is it always the high school students that have to solve these problems? To defend the school Alex, you know the answer. The adults can't get anything done. Days. <sighs> An academy shrouded in secrecy. Whoa. And the unavoidable loss of allies. Can Takumi survive this hundred day trial, colored by extreme and despair, and return to his normal life? The creators of Dongan Rampa present the Hundred Line Last Defense Academy, launching Whoa, on Nintendo that is Switch a title early treatment. next year. Embark on a saga spanning generations. Mm, I don't think so. <laughs> a full remake of Romancing Saga 2 is marching on to Nintendo Switch. Probably should be noted. The Empire of Varen across we are not the JRPG the aficionados that we that you might assume we are. It, it, we should we should probably just clarify. In, combat, in case anyone was wondering. In case, <laughs> like in case to learn there's any confusion. 
formations to enhance abilities. Listen, Vinny, I've played many JRPGs, okay? Oh, yeah. I played where the action like a dragon, Yakuza 7. Uh-huh. I played features like, like a dragon, Infinite Wealth. Uh-huh. I played Personas 4 and 5. Uh-huh. And in which order you played, you played a couple of Dragon Quests on the Nintendo? Probably played a Metal Gear. I'll put that. <laughs> that's pretty much a JRPG at some point. Safeguard your empire's future. You probably watched. I played Chrono Cross. Oh, there you go. Okay. Before I ever played Chrono Trigger. <laughs> That's about what I got. I played a couple of Final Fantasies over the years. Not for very long, though. I used to like JRPGs. I still like a JRPG here and there. There are just too many JRPGs. If one hits me, I will play it through to completion. It's just that a lot of them don't hit me. That's almost everything for today's Nintendo Direct. Almost. Next will be our last announcement. Please take a look. Does Eternal Sonata count as a JRPG? Probably. It has the words of a JRPG title, so <laughs> yes. Metroid. This is the one more thing. Metroid? 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 I'm still thinking Metroid? I'm still thinking F Zero. I wish it was F Zero, but it's probably Metroid. It's Metroid. I would rather it was F Zero, honestly, but that's just me. Oh, oh Prime! my gosh! Oh, are we are we priming? Oh, we're priming, baby! Coming 2027. Yeah, right, right, right. Oh, no date. C coming 20 XX. Yeah. Listen, we knew they were making a game. Jeff Grubb told me as much. <laughs> Nintendo's very own Silk Song. Mm -hmm. This is going to be the Straddler, right? Like, this is going to be the Switch Switch 2 Straddler. <sighs> it's there. Do you just put it on a Switch 2? We want you to get beyond Metroid Prime 4 because we're not making it, okay? No date. No date? Think they do a date after this? Uh, <clears throat> I don't know. I think it'll be a date. I don't know what kind of date it's going to be, though. Okay. If it, <clears throat> if it is 2025, anything 2025... I do have to wonder what their strategy is for their next Switch that successor. I'm telling you, this is the Straddler. This is going to be their Zelda yeah. thing straddling the two consoles. After a very long time, we are finally able to share more information about this title. Release is planned for 2025. So please wait a little bit longer. Because I'll tell you why. You're looking forward to Samus Aran's new adventure. I mean, it doesn't look like not a Switch That's game. For today's Nintendo yeah. Game. Thank you I didn't expect it to look astronomically better than a Switch game, to be honest with you. Maybe they're showing the Switch version if it's coming to whatever the next yeah. thing is. Okay. Yeah. Proof of life for Metroid yeah. Prime 4. That yeah. is, I think, probably the only thing people were really hoping for out of this. And a 2025 date, we got that new Zelda game. That was uh, very cool. Cool to see. Yeah. Um, uh, the Mario and Luigi game. That was also yeah. cool. Uh, Sorry to all the sil Silk Song heads out there that <laughs> somehow pinned their hopes to this thing. Stop doing that. Uh, <laughs> you're just going to be disappointed. Mm -hmm. uh, a bunch of stuff that you and I are probably not going to remember release. Like, um, just not our wheelhouse. No. Um, but there you I go. Mean, again, stuff in there. For an end of, near end of life Switch Nintendo Direct that was as measured as expectations can get, I was whelmed. It's fine. It was yeah. fine. There was stuff in there for sure. Um, and I think if you if, look, if you're into some of those JRPG franchises, probably even more mm -hmm. stuff for you. Uh, yeah, I, I am going to keep remaking them. I am curious what their release date will be and what their rollout will be come whatever the Switch successor is. Obviously, that's the biggest question mark in 2025. Do they mm -hmm. announce anything in 2024 leading up to that? 
Are there single purchases and bringing your Switch games into this new console or downloading the different versions of, of those games if they do um, share any DNA? You know what I mean? Like, can you, yeah. can you buy a Metroid Prime 4 and then just get it on both platforms at some point? Probably not. To, probably not. It's a Nintendo, right? It's Nintendo, so probably yeah, not. So probably not. I feel like at this point, the best case scenario is that uh, whenever you subscribe to whatever their new uh, Nintendo Switch online thing is, all the games that were available on the Switch will just also work on the Switch too. The old games, your catalog, right? Yes, your catalog of old games. Yeah. But as far as like Switch games go, I would have to guess that it's probably stuff that was made for the Switch will be backward compatible. Yeah. But. As far as like buying Metroid Prime 4 goes, you are probably buying either a Switch or a Switch 2 version, if I had to guess. So you don't think you got some enhanced upgrade version? Uh, Has Nintendo some... really done any of that up to this point? I don't think they have. Well, you know, Nintendo's a weird one because they make such big hardware shifts sometimes that really affect the, you know, the controller. Like, you know, from Wii to Switch is just not the same kind of console. Yeah, um, and you know, so it depends. It also depends what the Switch successor is. I personally think it'll probably be very similar to the Switch, but I think the architecture is going to be very similar. It's just yeah. going to be slightly, you know, beefier, basically. So yeah, I don't know. Uh, I guess we'll see uh, what happens there. That's a kind of bigger mm -hmm. question, but yeah, plenty. That's of stuff. a little further down the road. Uh, we'll talk more about it on Wednesday during uh, the podcast. I think uh, Brad has a couple more things as the embargoes go up to talk about from the not E3 stuff, some stuff he saw mm -hmm. in L.A. Uh, we'll see what that winds up being. You can catch us on Wednesday for more stuff. Like Alex mentioned before, we're going to go. We're going to record uh, the watch cast in a little bit so you can catch that over on the Patreon. Patreon.com slash Nextlander to catch more of that stuff. Thanks, everybody, for joining us and supporting us. Thanks, Alex. Thank you. And we'll be back soon. See everybody. Bye.